National Geographic Kids Readers. T-Rex by Andrea Simon. T-Rex rules. You would not want to mess with Tyrannosaurus Rex. Tyrannosaurus Rex, T-Rex, was one of the most powerful dinosaurs on Earth. T-Rex had big teeth. It had sharp claws. And it was as long as a bus. Yikes! Let's meet this big, fierce, fierce dinosaur. Where T-Rex lived. T-Rex walked on Earth millions of years ago. It lived in parts of North America. Some scientists, scientists, think these dinosaurs lived alone. Others think they may have lived and hunted in groups. T-Rex lived in areas such as present-day Montana and Wyoming, USA. Hunting in groups would have made it easier to catch a meal. What do you call a sleeping T-Rex? A dino-snore. T-Rex parts. This dinosaur's body was strong and deadly. Each foot was longer than a tennis racket. T-Rex walked on its toes. T-Rex's eyes worked really well. They helped the dinosaur find animals to eat. Each arm had two fingers with claws on the ends. Each claw was about the length of a soda can. The dinosaur's jaws were super strong. Its bite could have crushed a car. Its teeth were the size of bananas. They could break bones in half. Time for dinner. T-Rex was a carnivore. Carnivore. It ate other animals. T-Rex was fierce, but not fast. It probably couldn't catch speedy animals. T-Rex may have tried, but failed to grab fast dinosaurs like these Struthiomimus. Struthiomimus. But it could catch slower plant-eating dinosaurs. Once it did, its huge jaws opened wide. Then its big teeth chomped down on its meal. Slow Edmontosaurus, Edmontosaurus, was a likely meal for T-Rex. T-Rex talk. Carnivore, an animal that eats meat. T-Rex used its sharp teeth to rip off chunks of meat. Scientists think T-Rex sometimes tossed the meat into the air. Then it would catch the meat in its mouth and swallow it whole. T-Rex hunted live animals. But like most predators today, it also ate dead animals it found. T-Rex tots. Like other dinosaurs, T-Rex moms laid eggs. Scientists think the eggs might have taken months to hatch. T-Rex parents may have guarded their eggs to keep them safe. T-Rex egg fossils have not been found yet. But baby T-Rex might have hatched from eggs that look like this. Scientists think T-Rex moms could have laid about 20 eggs at one time. When the babies hatched, they were the size of small turkeys. And they likely had a fluffy, feather-like covering on parts of their bodies. A young T-Rex grew fast. It may have gained more than four pounds a day over many years. As they grew, they may have lost this downy covering. 
Scientists don't know if the adults had feathers. What did the baby T-Rex say after hatching? I feel excellent. Six cool things about T-Rex. One, T-Rex could eat 500 pounds of meat in one bite. Two, new research suggests that a young T-Rex likely had a stronger bite than an adult lion or tiger. Three, rare footprints likely from T-Rex have been discovered in Montana and New Mexico, USA. Four, T-Rex had about 50 to 60 teeth. Five, it snacked on other dinosaurs, like Triceratops. Triceratops. Six, T-Rex probably didn't roar like in the movies. Instead, it may have hissed like an alligator or even hooted like a bird. Finding T-Rex. T-Rex has been extinct, extinct, for a long time. We know about the dinosaur from fossils. Some fossils are bones. They are buried in rock. Scientists dig them up. T-Rex talk. Extinct. No longer alive. When all members of an animal species are dead, the species is extinct. Fossil. Parts or traces of a living thing that have been preserved in rock. The bones can tell scientists about T-Rex's shape and size. They can also tell how T-Rex lived and died. Other fossils show T-Rex skin. The skin left prints in mud. The mud hardened into rock to make fossils. The fossils show that adult T-Rex likely had pebbly scales on many parts of its body. A model of T-Rex shows what scales on its skin probably looked like. T-Rex talk. Scales. Small, hard plates of skin that overlap. Why was the T-Rex skeleton always laughing? It had a real funny bone. Meet Sue and Scotty. Scientists have dug up about 50 different T-Rex skeletons. Many are missing a lot of bones. The most complete skeleton was found in South Dakota, USA. The skeleton nicknamed Sue is at the Field Museum in Chicago, Illinois, USA. It was nicknamed Sue. Sue is as long as a bus. It is one of the largest T-Rex skeletons. Sue is the most complete T-Rex fossil ever found. Only a few bones are missing. Scotty is on display at the Royal Saskatchewan Museum in Saskatchewan, Canada. Another very large skeleton was found in Canada. Scientists think the dinosaur weighed as much as 19,500 pounds. They nicknamed the skeleton Scotty. Experts also believe Scotty lived more than 30 years. That likely makes Scotty one of the oldest T-Rex ever found. All in the family. T-Rex may be extinct, but it has living relatives. Birds like chickens and ostriches. Ostriches are related to T-Rex. That means you can see some of T-Rex's family members today. Today's birds are living dinosaurs. In some ways, an ostrich skeleton looks similar to a T-Rex skeleton. What is a T-Rex's least favorite exercise? Push-ups. What in the world? These pictures are up-close views of things from a T-Rex's world. 
Use the hints to figure out what's in the pictures. Answers are on page 31. Glossary. Carnivore. An animal that eats meat. Extinct. No longer alive. When all members of an animal species are dead, the species is extinct. Fossil. Parts or traces of a living thing that have been preserved in rock. Scales. Small, hard plates of skin that overlap.